Hello everyone, we are now here in the mountain uh, going to the flowers that they have seen in the Lisa. mountain. I'm in Lisa. And here is the place. Oh, yeah. As you could I'm see, the Lisa. place yeah. is a forest. So many trees. Then this is the way going there. I have two companions. And this is very, very difficult, very difficult because the way is not good. It's very, it's very difficult to walk. So many grass. As they could see the flower. The flower they have said that its form a triangle. So that's why I decided to go to that place and to see what's really the situation there. So this is the way going there. And there is a kaingin here. There is a kaingin. So this is the life of the people uh, of this place. In order to live, you should have a kaingin for survival. And they plant here rice. The upland rice as you could see the upland rice it is already green but it's not beer fruit already so guys we try to speak english because some of our viewers requested to speak English so that's why we have to, to try to speak English even it's hard or it's difficult for me to speak English but we will try because we as Filipino we are not fluent in speaking English because that's not our own language but we can speak so this is the place we are at the top of the mountain then this is the forest so from here Maybe we can walk uh, at least uh, 30 minutes from here. So it is interesting guys because this is also hiking in the mountain and you could also discover some of the nature's beauty here the trees you could witness the trees it's very green and it's nice to look at but the most important here guys is the hiking the benefits of hiking
hiking and also discovering the place either the plants that we see is a Yamashita treasure sign or it is just a flower that was planted by our ancestors long ago so we could witness because as they said the flower is so big no so sabi pa nila it year uh mga how many years the flowers they said it might be the time of the japanese occupancy in the philippines because that flower though according to them according to this my companions the only seed of flower in the cities and they amaze why this kind of flower this seed is uh, this sort of flower in the mountain that's why they try to dug out the flower and now we are here in the in the Kaingin area again another Kaingin area this is the life of the people living in the mountains you should know how to plant rice the apple rice the corn and also other plants for survival purposes and that's the hut that we could see nearby so let's witness what kind of hut also that these people living in this place they have made there is an okra okra along the way this forest is not a virgin forest because the trees are not so big so that's why this is not a virgin forest here we are approaching to the hut of the owner of this place here as we could see the wall is made of the skin of the trees and this is the place it's nice and at the back of this uh, mountain there the flower located so this is it guys the place but we have to take some rest first because of the long hours of hiking going to this place we are tired that's why we have to take rest first and we have to try to see the mountains because according to them also the mountain uh, in front of this mountain they have also so a box of uh, like box a cemented box on the top of this mountain where in this top of the mountain is a virgin forest the trees are very big so, maybe next time we could visit this place again this place because this is awesome place
So this is the kind of flower that they have said they have seen in that place. So now we are going to visit that flowers because they have said that it's formed like a triangle. So it might be if it is a treasure or it is a re real treasure. The Yamashita treasure. It might be have a deposit. But if it's just planted by the people who first occupied in this place, it is just plants. But we just trying to see if it is either a Yamatsita treasure sign or it's just a plant planted by the people inhabited, inhabited in this place. So this is it, the way going out there, it's difficult to pick up the mountain, it's hard to reach. Yeah, that's very good. And this is it, the rice. Yeah. Okay, we are now on the top of the mountain. There. We are approaching here. We are approaching here. To the site. Because according to them, they have already operated that place because it sounds like there is a hole beneath the ground. So that's why they tried to dug it out. Hoping to find something, but they don't find something. So here, Tumbaman this lagi. is it. This is the flower Tumbaman that they have said that the amazing wonder ah. why this kind of flower is located in this place. So this is now the duck that they have made. Maybe this is one meter plus. So this is the flower that they wonder why this flower is planted in this place wherein this is a forest. So one thing also that boosts their interest because this flower is planted in a triangle form. One flower is from this uh, dug site and also one is okay that flower it's a big flower according to them this is big kinalutay diri no oh okay we are here to scan the area to find something whether this area is positive or negative so we will scan the area. So nice, this is the digging site. Malaki na yung ginagawa nilang hukay Nasa 1 to 2 meters na siguro ang lalim nito Kasi iba yung kanyang tunog eh Sa ilalim Tumutunog talaga siya Okay guys, let's scan the area so that we could find out if this is the one of the Yamashita treasure sign. So that these people that dug on this place 
They could stop if this is negative. Mayroon kasi yung kalot ng kalot eh, yung kuan, yung hukay na hukay. Tapos wala kang gamit, wala kang detector. Maabot ka na lang ng ilang metro. Wala kang makukuha. That's why they hired me to scan the area. So that they could stop digging. You know, try to see that the scanner detected nothing in this place. Yeah, yeah. And it might be their effort will be nothing also. Sulit bang ka ng Utah liha? Hmm. Wala na, hindi ako sa sulit. Para maghumok po doon, ah, humok mo. Malaki talaga ang maitutulong kapag mayroon tayong gadget guys. No, sa mga treasure hunter. Para nga, humok po, humok eh ba? Ang recommend ko sa inyo guys, mas mabuti po may treasure, mayroon tayong gadget. Para hindi tayo magbubungkal kahit saan na lang. Kahit anong makita, bubungkalin, babasagin. So this is now the place. No, we have already done scanning that place, and we found nothing, and we scanned negative. So we're going home because we find out that that area is negative of Yamashita treasure. So they will not continue digging from that place. And they have to look another sign, and they have to find another sign, guys. So that's the very essence of having a gadget or a scanner detector. Because wala na talaga ng masisira pa na mga kalikasan. No, it's better to have this kind of gadget. So we will go home guys and hopefully you enjoy the video and also witness how difficult is finding the Yamashita treasure and also finding treasures is not easy. You have to go to the mountains, go to the riverside, go to the seaside and wherever you go just to find. Yamashita treasure but we will not uh, be discouraged of finding Yamashita treasure maybe not now our time but in the coming time we can find it so continue continue to watch my videos and continue to follow me and subscribe also to my channel so that you can be updated of my new uploads thank you guys let's go home this is the place where we are we are the top of the mountain looking at the sea and the breeze of the air it's very cold and it's very nice thank you thank you guys bye bye